Bro, what was the point of you even responding? You just supposed to do lame shit like this, bro, bro. I met this girl two months ago inside Miami, bro. I took a six-hour flight, bro. I'm inside her hotel room, bro. I'm inside my hotel room. I booked the whole room, booked the flight, booked everything, bro. I get inside the city, bro. This dumb man, bro, she not even responding, bro. I've been here for two days, two days, bro. I, I, I booked this hotel for a whole week, bro. I spent money, a flight, everything, bro. She ain't even responding, bro. It got to the point I'm, I'm sleeping on two beds trying to make me feel better and shit like that, bro. And I just don't get the point, bro. It's like, bro, it's pointless, bro. Why was the point of you making me even come this far, bro? It wasn't even for the life. If you was going to be on games, I could have stayed inside Miami, bro. You got me waiting inside California for no reason, bro. For no reason at all, you feel me? Like, what was the point of you even acting like you was for to respond, bro? You, we made these plans. I get inside town, you just fully ghost me, bro. What's the point of that shit, bro? I'm done crying, bro, and I'm done doing this with females, bro. This is why I say meeting girls in Miami for spring break is out the equation, bro. Like, I could have been on my lonely, bro. You came inside my life. You ain't have to f with me, bro. This shit crazy, bro. And I, I'm tired. I've been crying for two days, bro, and I'm tired of this shit. It's just sad, bro. I'm sleeping on two beds like, like I got a bunk bed or something, bro. Bro, I just got to Boston, bro. When I tell y'all, bro, I would never, ever, ever ride with Spirit again, bro. I would never do it again. I call myself trying to be cheap, bro. Why nobody told me with Spirit? If you get a ticket that's twenty dollars, that don't mean anything, man. When I say it, will, it sound good because it might be twenty, thirty dollars. He's like, oh, they, he's like, okay, that you came up. When I tell y'all, boys, I ended up spending over like three hundred dollars for this flight. It's crazy, bro. But it's small ass bad. They charged me a hundred. I thought it was a person. I don't know what a person who in a carry on is. I thought we could just bring one bag. I'm used to riding dust with my baby. They charged me a hundred for the bag, bro. I asked, I'm, a, I'm on the plane. I'm chilling. I, ain't gonna lie. I got kind of hungry. You feel me? I asked the lady for a bag of chips. She said twenty dollars. I'm like, damn. All I got was a, all I got was a cup of water and a bag of Fritos. You feel me? Twenty dollars. But why nobody told me? Like, that's the cat story, you feel me? I'm thinking this whole time that, oh, people just talking about spirit. It ain't that bad. Another thing, too. But I'm seats hard as hell. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm inside the plane like this for three hours, you feel me? You got to sit up straight. I couldn't sag or anything like that. I'm like, damn, I can't do it, you feel me? I ain't no TVs, everything expensive. I was scared to ask for a piece of gum. I know she was going to say about 30. I'm done riding with spirit, man. Back to Delta. No more being cheap.